Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Good evening and welcome to Alcor, welcome to the Al Bight Stadium, the venue for this one. My name is Derek Ray and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Costa Rica versus Japan. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. And here's the starting 11 for Costa Rica. Well, it's great to see them playing with the front two, but for it to work, they need to have a good understanding. They need to link up with each other and provide a different set of skills. And here's the starting 11 for Japan. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And they kick off here. Difficult to stop him. But timely defending when it mattered. Tremendous ball played through. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Now, who can he play it to? Well, no way through. Gerson Torres. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, Derek, his outstanding attribute is his pace. Not just over the first few yards, but over longer distances as well. And that makes him so difficult to play against. Defenders are unsure whether to get tight or drop off. A dynamic player. Ko Itakura. No, high quality defending. Contreras Campbell on the ball it did look on for them but not to be teammates available this looks threatening and gobbled up with ease by the keeper giving the ball away Wonderfully weighted pass. Real chance. 
quite simply an opportunity wasted easy for the keeper the referee is given a corner Well, they're going for the short one. Gaku Shibasaki. He's got space. Well, let's see about the cross. A very effective clearance. Gerson Torres trying to really get at the opposition here but nothing comes of it Asano Kamada excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward Minamino has a go it was always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball Well, as the stats tell us, they just haven't created enough chances. They need to get the ball into wide areas, get crosses into the box, and then... Oh, get wait their... a minute, Stuart. Opportunity. And a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it, and now they've been rewarded. Well, you have to admire this bit of play. Just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Determined defending. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. And saved by the keeper. <laughs> and now the delivery. Not the best clearance. Can he convert? And a body in the way. Didn't fall the keeper. And so it is. The first half story has been written. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Kamada. Anthony Contreras. Campbell. Made sure nothing came of that. A smart stop here. And he's fired over the corner. Can they slot at home? Well, the goalkeeper got there in the end. Well, his recovery is brilliant here. So athletic. Well read to win possession back.
Jewison Bennett. Gaku Shibasaki. Now, who can he play it to? Well, able to close down the short. Chance to set up an equaliser from the corner. Can he deliver it with accuracy? No real challenge for the goalkeeper. Of course, stats don't always tell the story, but on this occasion, they certainly do, because they haven't been good enough in the top third of the pitch. And I'm not sure we're going to see anything change here. It comes to nothing in the end. This could be the equaliser. But oh, what an important save! How about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there. They should be level now. Over it comes, and he clears the danger. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Celso Borges. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Ito. The cross is on. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. They've got it now, what can they do? Well, that'll be a free kick. Well, perhaps he thought he might escape punishment. Not the case, it's a booking. Inside the final 15 minutes. Mina Mino. Could be a chance to break here. And he's made headway. Well, quite simply, that is a wasted chance. Losing possession. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Well denied by the keeper, but really he only has himself to blame. Daichi Kamada. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between the sides. Contreras. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. Goal. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Yoshida. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. Oh, great play. Can they stop it going in? Well, 
that's the end of that for now. And there goes the final whistle. It goes into the history books as a win for them. So morale is high. Stuart, your analysis. Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.